Auschwitz. It's a concentration camp from the Nazi Party. Of course, we all know this is where the largest, greatest number of people died during the Holocaust and World War II under Hitler and the Nazi regime. Well, died is not necessarily a good word. Murdered. Murdered. 1.1 million people. 90% of them were Jews. Other people were like Jehovah Witness, Soviet Union soldiers, Polish politicians gay men, they... <sighs> so Auschwitz I used to be a Polish army barracks and when Hitler invaded Poland in um, 1939 he decided that was going to be the place he was going to execute primarily Jews. That camp was capable of holding how many people at once? maybe 30,000. Uh, so they brought in tens of thousands of people every other day or, or something like that. They simply didn't have room for more people. So basically, all those shoes that you saw there, it wasn't people who necessarily lived there. Most of it was probably from people who just immediately died. And whenever they went to the gas chamber, and they had to shower, but they also told them, remember where you put your clothes because you're gonna get it back. We went into an actual gas chamber, which was one of the first gas chambers in Auschwitz I. You know, the gas that they used uh, stripped the paint from the walls and discolor the walls. Yeah. So you can only imagine what it did to people's lungs. lungs. And then they probably didn't even know that the next room, there was a crematory. Schwitz two. Now I've seen documentaries, you've seen documentaries, mm -hmm. we've all read it in the history books, but to actually stand there and physically see how big Auschwitz II was, it was just unbelievable. The largest group of people there was Hungarians, so it kind of hit home with Mr. Benoit here. 450,000 people that died there at Auschwitz were from the country of Hungary itself. Definitely eye-opening, heart-wrenching. Make sure that will never, ever, ever happen again. We never forget what happened there. Never do it again. <laughs> <laughs>